Happy Vlogmas Day too. What's up, boys? Yeah. So why are you, why are you guys here already? So it's a um, no, it's Vlogmas Day one. Because it's no, no, no. Today's day two. It's because it's gonna go up tomorrow what? for day two. What? Today's December one. I know, but when this video goes up, it's gonna be December two. Okay. Anyway, did you guys have school today? Yes. Half day. Yes. Half day. Oh. Well, and what is this? You guys have to show what tell tell everyone what this is. What is that? I don't know. This delicious looking thing. What's that? Is that cake? It's yuzo cheesecake. Mm. With extra cheese on it. We use we extra use, cheese. Ooh. We use this. The top is a uh, yuzo lemon curd. It kind of looks like cheese. Lemon curd. And that is it's sweet. Candied. Candies is a lemon. Yes. Yeah, that's a lemon. That's yuzo lemon. Oh. Well, are we going to eat this right now? We and can. this is a lemon towel. Be careful, Isaac. Yes, it's a lemon towel. And this is a big popcorn. And this is a mushroom. A mushroom? And how about this little baby? Yeah. What's this? Yeah. Yeah. What did you do in school today? Math. Hmm. I did math. Did you do math? Hmm. What did you get in math? Hmm. Did you do in math? Hmm. All of them correct. All of them correct. Oh, okay, well, good. Good, job. good job. Good job, Eliza. College readiness. What happened, Zachary? I got college readiness on my uh, kind of ESA test. So you're ready for college? College readiness? Are you a baby genius? Are you? <laughs> oh, for reading. All right, how, are your, how are your apple chips? Oh, this is... This is day two of my apple dehydrating. What happened to your other apple chips? Oh, it's out. there. Oh, for us it's day one. For Yummy. us, okay. for us it's day one. For, for you guys it's day one. We brought some for school. Mm. Ah. And we ate some. And Yasmin. Alright you guys, it's time to cut oh, yeah. into our cheesecake. Ooh. I'm super excited. Oh my gosh. Oh. Mom, I'm gonna cut it. Cut it. We have to try it. I have to make sure well, it's good. We tried it already. <laughs> That's the second time yeah. I made it. Why oh, didn't put it in the refrigerator again? We well, have to do it in one day, in one. It's clean. It's because uh, there's a end. There's a little lip. Oh, the lip. Uh oh. This is hard with its um, stand. Yeah. <laughs> Could have transferred it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! I did it. Okay, this ugly one will be mine. I just want like, a very small one. Is it small enough? Yeah, very small. Like this? Yeah. The smallest. <laughs> so tiny. <laughs> Yeah, there you go. that's it. <coughs> Yummy! Time to eat. Let me get down. Try it, Mom. How is it? Mmm, so good. It's so good. I thought I made a mess, but it's okay. The use of curd is so yummy. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna try it right now. Oh my god, that's the one that made the cake. The cheese cake. This one. The cord. The cord. Mmm. It's so delicious. So delicious. You can use this, you can make this with lemon. If you guys want the recipe for this, mom will have it on her Instagram. 
It's gonna be down below in the description oh, box. Wait. It's Adrian's <laughs> mom on Instagram. Just send her a, send her a DM. Don't forget to follow her. <laughs> I have to. Right, it's so overcast today. Like it literally looks like it's nighttime already. But I was working on this, and this is like an image that I'm creating for OC Goodwill. They're gonna post for uh, normalizing secondhand gifts, and these are all just like secondhand items, with the exception of those two mushrooms that I thrifted. Oh, and those flowers are real. Uh, and these are all gonna be part of mom's thrift miss present so there it is um i think i'll show you guys exactly what's in here in a little bit but i actually just need to get the image finalized and then sh like, ship it off send it off to oc goodwill because it's due today i just want to get that done and then i have to go to the post office so we'll do like a what's in my mom's thrift miss present thing when i get back also, we just ate a couple little taquitos for like a late lunch. And over here, mom's getting dinner ready. This is like a chicken that she pre-made this a bit ago and it was in the fridge. And we're gonna have that for dinner. It's really good, it's like a cranberry chicken. All right, you guys, it is a little bit later and I finally finished uh, submitting this stuff for, um, for OC Goodwill for Instagram and Packaged up the stuff. We're gonna go head over to the post office right now. Also, I just got off the phone with UPS and Tanya for watching. We almost have a resolution to that craziness that was happening with them. Um, I just have to, I don't know why they need me to resubmit it, but I'm just going to because they said that it should be done really soon. I just have to finalize submitting those documentations for that stuff and then we're gonna be a-okay. <laughs> so, I don't know, that has been a crazy whirlwind of an adventure with um, UPS, but we're gonna get it finished up very soon. Um, what else was I gonna tell you guys? I think we're also, oh, we also gotta go to Lowe's. I gotta go to Lowe's to get some stuff. Then we're gonna go to Lineage and then maybe Veterans, I don't know, but for sure Lineage and for sure, um, Lowe's. Just got to Lowe's. Let's go inside. I'm not gonna bring you guys with me though, because I'm just gonna run in and out. Okay guys, I got my box it's in the back. I just needed one of those like super sturdy boxes, so I got that. And I found this Ficus Triangularis, but it's the variegated one. I'm so excited. I've been looking for one of these forever. They actually had so many like good plants inside the store. And I was kind of amazed. They had a ficus, they had ficus Audrey, which those are pretty rare to find. And they were like in really nice shape. Um, they had this, which also pretty rare to find too. They had some really good monsteras. They had a lot of like cool plants. So I was pretty excited about it. And I almost bought this other one, which was an angel wing begonia, like the spotted one, but I already have like a pretty big plant. So I didn't get that, but yeah, I've never seen any of those plants at the at Lowe's before, so it's pretty cool to find them right now. But we're gonna head over to Lineage really quickly, and then after that, we'll decide if we're gonna go over to um, Veterans. All right, just got to Lineage training. I'm gonna go inside. Hey guys, okay, so I got back inside the car. It's super dark now, but let's see the lights. I got some really good stuff right there. So I'm pretty excited about it. Uh, they had like a dollar sale for some of their clothing and I know I'm gonna have to probably like wash some of it. So that stuff isn't gonna be in tonight's live sale. Yeah, I'm having a live sale tonight too. It's at 8 p.m. and it's currently six. Ooh, I probably should just, I, I think I'm actually gonna head over to the Goodwill really quick, which is just in the same shopping center. I don't think I'm gonna go to Veterans anymore. It's kind of far and they're gonna close in like an hour. So it's like definitely not even worth it. So I'm gonna go to Goodwill head home, have a quick dinner, and then do the live sale. So uh, I'll see you guys over at the Goodwill. All right, you guys, it is a little while later, and I got some goodies. Okay, so it's literally like a little bit past 11 p.m. Pacific time. I just finished doing my live sale tonight, so thank you so much if you joined. Comment down below if you did. Um, and we had a blast. And I wanted to show you guys what I ended up getting though today when I went over to Lineage. I unfortunately did not film really anything again today. It's like literally the worst. Um, so 
I don't even know if there's gonna be a video today. Um, I don't know, we'll see. Because I didn't really film anything. I was gonna go to Veterans Thrift. I didn't even end up going to Veterans because it was already late in the day. And I just had so much stuff that I had to do today. Um, stuff on the phone, stuff to, around the house. <laughs> so nothing like very exciting or film worthy. But let me show you guys what I ended up getting over at Lineage Trading because I did end up picking up some really good stuff. They were having a dollar sale in the clothing. And I picked up some clothes. I think I have to wash most everything, but this is the first thing I got. This is a Adidas track jacket in like this purple color. I don't know, it looks really fun. It kind of looks Versace-esque. And this was a size US small. Um, I think this might actually be like a men's jacket though, because it kind of looked big for like a women's small. So I think actually this is a men's, but cool. It was a dollar. Then I got this cardigan, and it's by Everlane, and it is just a nice, like, white cardigan, size small, really cute. It has, like, all the buttons. It has a stain, though, but my mom is really good at getting stains out, and I think she's going to make this look really good. I'm going to ask mom to help me um, fix this guy up, but it's really nice. Then I got um, this, uh, these are girlfriend shorts. And I looked these up, uh, the style is called Jordan, and the Jordan style shorts by this brand are actually one of the most expensive ones as far as the shorts go, so got this. Again, these were all just a dollar so far. Then I got this Wild Fox t-shirt, super cute, just has the stars, I really like the way that they did like the neck, like the collar and then the sleeves, I don't know, they're just really fun, looks kind of rainbow brightish, and Wild Fox. Then I think this is the coolest clothing piece that I got, especially because it's like literally brand new. And it is the these shorts. They're these shorts. There we go. They're these shorts by Farm Rio. And this is a collaboration with Anthropology. These are a size small. Look at the print on these. It's so cute. Um a, there's like a little belted detail. Oh, excuse me, I had like a weird hiccup. And then it has these little beads on it. So lots of fun little details that I thought was cool. Um, this is new with tags. It still has the Farm Rio tag. It has the Anthropology tag on there as well. So I had to pick it up for a dollar. Like, how could I say no, right? I can't believe I didn't go to this sale till late, though. They probably had some really good stuff. They had this sale since, um, like, Black Friday. So this is just, like, the tail end of it, but it's okay. Uh, then I got two bags. Um, first, uh, first one being this super cute Kurt Geiger, and I really like this bag. I like the color of the woven, like natural fibers. It's kind of like a. I don't think it's. I think it's coming up more gray on camera, but in real life, it's kind of like a gray blue color, and it has this gunmetal colored hardware for the straps, and then it has the little bird with the chain on there. So it's really cute. This was like around $20, I think is what this one was. Not too bad for a Kurt Geiger. These, like the resale value of those is probably around like $65, $75 or something. But this is the best thing that I found today. This one was like $125, but it comes with a dust bag and it is this beautiful Tory Burch. Uh, the retail of this bag is like $600. It's still being sold online right now. And it is a beautiful black quilted leather Tory Burch shoulder bag. It's actually convertible, so you can wear it as a shoulder or a crossbody. Gold hardware. Look at that. Quilting and Tory Burch on top. The body has this diamond quilting. It's super clean inside it's all leather too so it's leather inside as well there's a zipper pocket and then two open pockets like it's really 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 nice so i got super lucky um with this bag because i feel like normally this would have sold really quickly but they kind of just had it on a shelf where they keep just like random bags um so i don't know how i got so lucky finding this over there but it was a little expensive but i think it's totally worth it tori birch Gorgeous. I was so excited that I actually went there today. So, um, But that is it. That is going to end, I guess, today's video. I guess this is a shorter little vlog. I think I'm just going to put it out because I did have like a super 
fun haul. I think this haul is pretty cool of stuff that I got. Um, this was just from a really quick trip to that store too. So it just goes to show like you can go to your local thrift stores or consignment, secondhand stores, whatever, and just pop in for like 20 minutes and you can find some really good stuff. Um, I was just in there for like 20 minutes because the store was literally closing already. I didn't know that they closed so early on weekdays. And I went to Lowe's first so I can get that box. Oh, I did get that plant. <gasps> Wait, I didn't show you guys the plant. Hold on. I, I did end up getting this plant from Lowe's because I had to go buy a box to mail something. I needed a big box. And I found this ficus triangular. And I actually have a large one of these over there, if you can see in the corner. But it's a regular one. The leaves are just like a regular green. This is a variegated one. So it's pretty cool. I've been launching one of these for a while. Now I was trying to find one online, but they're all really expensive. I don't know what, like, I don't know. They're really expensive. I know how plants can get really expensive though. But this was only 20 bucks over at Lowe's. So they had this, they had a ficus Audrey. Ficus Audrey's are really expensive too. And I have one outside. We just chopped it down for the winter and we have um, some branches propagating and yeah, they had those, they had monsteras, they had really cool plants. So I was really excited. They even had um, spotted angel wing begonias, which are pretty rare to find also. They were big. They're like almost as big as the one I have. And the one I have is like pretty large now. And I got it like it was a lot smaller. Um, and I think they were all around $20 or something. So pretty excited about this. I have it right there on the kids table right now. And oh, I was going to show you guys what, okay. I guess the video is going to keep going because I was going to show you guys what I got. Um, in my mom's thrifted uh, present thing. So, okay, hold on. Let me just put this one back. I'm gonna show you guys quickly what's inside of here. I'm not gonna show you guys like too intensely, but so these are all thrifted things that I got for my mom. Um, this is gonna be in her, what do you call it? Like, uh, I call it like, thriftmas for the holidays, right? And all of these are just like thrifted things that I got at the Goodwill that I've collected. Over the past few weeks, um, yeah, I think the oldest item that I have in here is probably this little reindeer that I got like a month or two ago. And everything else is in within the past like month or just the past week. So this beautiful like punch bowl, it's iridescent and amazing and it goes with those anthropology cups that I got. So I'm really, really excited about it. And we got this guy. Um, it still has a sticker on the bottom. I haven't even washed it off yet. It was $7.99. So that was a deal in and of itself. And then we got this cute little reindeer, $2.99. Uh, I got all of these little um, accessories. There's a Kate Spade for her AirPods, um, Heyday charger, um, Heyday phone, like a watch or watch band. Um, and then a watch charger from Heyday as well. Got some perfumes. There's this really pretty iridescent candle. It smells really good. It's from Target. And then the last, oh, I got also these two perfumes. The brand is called um, Iyamasqua, I think is what it's called. It smells so good. Oh my gosh. It's so amazing. And I got these really cool silk pajamas. You would have seen all these things in, or you will see most of these things coming up, or you have seen them already in other thrifting videos. Um, but this one is by a brand called Avery and these pajamas are like over a hundred something dollars retail and I got them brand new, they still have tags on and uh, mom already saw them, she loves them and I was like I just need to like take a photo of them really quick for like a uh, for an Instagram thing for Goodwill and yeah so here it is our lift our little thrift thrifted punch bowl <laughs> and I know like a lot of people like to do baskets but I'm like the punch bowl is perfect because like mom will actually like use the punch bowl. She loves the punch bowl. We love the punch bowl. And I don't know like baskets are cool too because you can use those but we already have enough baskets so why not use the little punch bowl. Even the paper in the bottom it was used to pack up the punch bowl when I purchased it at the Goodwill. So I was able to put that to use too by just patting the bottom a little bit and giving it some elevation. And there we go. That is our little... Um, thriftmas present for mom. I, I know I have more stuff too, so this is just a tiny bit of it, but thriftmas is the best. I love it. So let me know if you guys like um, to give secondhand gifts as well. I love it. If I can, I will. And I probably almost always will. It's very rare that I don't. And everyone already knows, like in my family, that I, I love to thrift and find secondhand stuff. And yeah, so they just like, come to expect it. They love it. And 
I love it. So, well, that's the end. Hope you guys had fun. Tune in tomorrow for day three of Vlogmas and happy day two. All right, hope you guys are having a great December so far. Um, again, don't forget two videos every single day, a thrifting video in the morning and then the vlog up in the afternoon and there probably will be some sort of vlogging at the thrift store in the vlog episode as well just so I can have more content in the videos too. Um, but yeah, that's the end. Love you guys so much and see you guys on the next one. Adios!